Hello everyone, I am Dr. Javed Iqbal Khokar, Professor of Forensic Medicine and Toxicology. From this lecture, you should have understood that I will be discussing firearms. And in this lecture, I will be discussing what is rifling. And it makes a weapon called as a rifled weapon. And they are called rifled firearm weapons because of rifling. These are called rifled because the inside of the bore is rifled. And this is one basis of the classification of firearms. That is either the weapon is smooth bored, that the barrel is smooth, it is not rifled and rifling make is a rifled firearm. So what is rifling? It means that inside of the bore is cut longitudinally with a number of spiral grooves which run parallel to each other but are spirally twisted from chamber end to the muzzle end. These raised portions are called lands and the load one are called grooves. And this is how it appears when you look from the muzzle end. The lands and grooves, they are spirally arranged, twisted parallel to each other. This is a cut section showing the grooves and the lands. And this is another view, photograph of showing the spirally arranged. And what is the function of rifling? The advantages is that it gives the gyroscopic stability to the bullet. It increases the accuracy of the bullet to the target it prevents the bullet from wobbling as it travels through the air. That is, bullet remains stable by the spin which is given by the rifling. Then this determines the bore. The gauge or caliber is the land to land width of the barrel and it is expressed in one over hundredth of an inch or in millimeters. These are the lands and the grooves and the distance between two opposite lands is the bore in the rifled weapon. Thank you very much. If you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel and this is my channel name, Dr. Javed Iqbal Kokhar, 